Good morning, boys and girls. I am so grateful to see some of you during our Zoom meeting on Tuesday. Thank you for coming and thank you for participating and sharing your uh, special thing that you've been doing at home. Um, today, Miss Wambo is going to talk to you about two things. I'm going to tell you a secret and then we're going to talk about our journal. Are you ready? <gasps> I'm excited. Let's see what's in the mystery bag. What what do you think is in here? Let me take a look. Ta -da -da. Ta -da 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 -da. What do you think that is? That's a water bowl. And somebody has come to drink some water from Miss Wamboy's water bowl. Who do you think that is? Huh? If you say the zebra, you're right. Now I'll tell you a secret about the zebra. Now Miss Wamboy speaks several languages. And in one language that I speak, it's called my native language. It's called the Kikuyu language. And it's spoken by Kikuyu people who live in Kenya, a country called Kenya in Africa. And that's where Miss Wamboy comes from. Now in the Kikuyu language, we call the zebra. Would you like to know what we call the zebra? We call the zebra Waboy Meredo. It means Wamboy, the striped one. Wamboy who has stripes. So, in my native language, we call the zebra Wamboy. And, that, and because that's my name, that's my favorite animal. Okay. So, in today's journal lesson, we are going to be talk, writing the two things that we talked about. A journal has the date. And what we talked about or what happened on that day, okay? So today is, I have a sentence strip there, you can see. Today is Thursday, comma, take a pause, April 30th, comma, take a pause. The year is 2020, period. Stop. The sentence has come to an end. Remember, today starts with a big t or uppercase t okay uppercase t remember a sentence is lying on a straight line every word in the sentence is sitting on the straight line please tell your big brother or big sister if you have one or mommy or daddy to write this sentence for you and then you're going to copy it in your journal okay please do that i know you can do it it's hard but I, can, I know what you're able to do, so I know you can do it, okay? Come graduation time, I know you will, most of us will be able to do this. And we'll be very grateful for what you have been able to achieve, okay? Now, Miss Wamboy tried to draw a zebra here. So some of our friends will draw the zebra so that they remember on today's date we were talking about the zebra. And then... Or some of our friends can even ask their mommies or daddies to help them spell the word zebra. And why we are talking about zebra today is because this week Miss Janice is going to be introducing the last letter of the alphabet, which is Z. Okay? So bright big Z there and small Z, uppercase Z or small and lowercase Z. Now, the zebra here I do is very simple. Okay? I know you can do it. I used shapes. Look at that. What shape do you think that the body is? It has two long sides and two short sides. Take a guess. Very good. This is a rectangle. Rectangle for the body. Look at the head. The head is a small rectangle also. Two long sides. Two short sides. Look at the legs. They are also rectangles. The two front legs are rectangles. Two long sides, two short sides, okay, for the front legs. Look at the back legs. 
it looks like a square so if you draw little squares for the back sides will be shorter than the rectangle front legs and guess what you'll be drawing a three-dimensional figure 3d have you heard of 3d you'll be drawing a 3d figure and i know you can do it okay look at the tail is a rectangle also that is diagonal it's like slanting we call that diagonal two long sides two short sides and you put some hairs in the tail okay look at that i know you can do it okay so that's what we'll be doing in our journal today and look at miss wamboy she's been collecting a lot of papers and we can make this into a booklet if you don't have a journal like this one of miss wamboy or the one that we used for stud put all your papers together okay this one is for the cupcake that we did for Kaylee the other day. And this one was the first one we did for the journal. We said it was sunny. Put all those papers together and make a little booklet like um, Miss Susan showed you. Okay? Put them together and tell mommy or daddy to help you. Staple them and you'll have your little journal going on. Okay? Otherwise, have a blessed day. And hope you're working hard and helping mommy and daddy at home. We'll see you soon. Bye.